So I got a bit distracted between the last race and this one. Didn't manage to set a qualifying time, so we're doing another attempt from the back. But this one might be either equally as interesting or hopefully uh, result in a better result. One of the two, let's see. Uh, I still can't get over getting fast slap on the last, uh, the last race. Don't know if it'll happen again. We've got the same guy up top though. With a 37.6. So let's see, from the back, here we go. In the McLaren F1, by the way, I think I forgot to mention that in the last video, uh, seems to be the top 10 of choice, except for a Peugeot VGT, uh, which should not be allowed, and um, a GTR, at the point of recording this anyways, literally they're the only two cars that are not, that are not the McLaren in the top 10. So I thought I would copy. P16, I don't know where he's at, He's literally on the last corner, miles away, and not moving by the looks of it. We'll let these guys kill each other in this, uh, in this chicane here, I think. A few places made up already. I don't know that. <laughs> what is it about Monza that people just drop like flies? And a penalty being served here. Another position there, lovely stuff. P10. Right then, here we go. Let's see if we can catch up to the back of this Corvette in the slipstream. Oh, he's just pulling away with the slipstream in front of him, actually. I think this no chicane has thrown everyone off. Everyone, this doesn't seem to be a normal Monza race. <laughs> it really doesn't. This is not going to end well. Five cars up ahead here. There it is. Two already wide. Three going into the chicane. One already wide. <laughs> Another already. We could be on for a podium here. Look at the state of this. P4 clipping the wall there. Bump draft the Corvette for now, don't we? Oh, he's braked very early there. Very early. almost pushed the Corvette pass to give him P4, but then he, uh, the Mustang outdoes him in the braking zone. He could be on for P4 here then. Maybe not, the Corvette's just gonna push the Mustang along. Yeah. I want the slipstream of the, must of the Corvette.
Right, we're fighting for P4 here, I think then. Ooh, P3 with a poor uh, with a P3 with a podium. <laughs> P3 with a penalty. He'd be given away his podium. I think it's a half second penalty he's served. P4 will be right on the back of him here. Good driving for me at all. Yeah, I don't think. Uh, the Corvette's gone for it there, but I think he should have waited. He should have tried to have the pit straight instead. We're going to try and get through here, though, at least up to P5. I think we will do, you know. We could get past the two of them here if we slingshot past in the slipstream. Have a look at this. I'm gonna go at the inside though. Indeed, indeed, he tries to pull out, it's not gonna happen. Slingshot past the two of them. I'm gonna go at the inside here. Off the grass, get off the grass. Right, last lap, P4, as it stands. Do our very best to keep it that way. I think P3 at this point is just, just out of reach. 150 metre board. good in that chicane. The Corvette's going to be looking for it here, I think, in the braking zone. He's going to fancy it. Oh, I've had a break, I've had a break. No, no, no. Oh, thankfully the power of the McLaren. <laughs> Just about keeps us the position. P4. Insane. Is this just going to be the maddest race of the week? I really can't. Uh, I really can't work it out. I can't work out what's going on. We got someone in the Huracan there finishing P2. Good result for a hurric for the Huracan. That was bizarre. We made up 12 places. I tell you what, it'd be good for DR though. It'd be very very good for DR that. But they just seem. We just seem to. Uh, to just part the traffic. <laughs> Everybody, it was like a game of Mario Kart that. Everybody just off the track, up the walls, upside down, back to front. Crazy, 11 positions, sorry, 11 positions, P15 we started. There we go then, I will definitely, definitely, definitely take P4. Probably the best result I think you could hope for, uh, or one of the best results you could hope for when starting from the back. That is absolutely mega. See if we can do that again, eh? Or should we just uh, start setting quality times? I think we should start setting quality times. <laughs> I don't think we'd be that lucky uh, each time that we start from the back. But what a race that was. Really, really good. Uh, hope you enjoyed it. Please make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. Plenty more videos on the way. Uh, and if I get this out in time, this video, I'll be live streaming tonight. Uh, Monday, potentially Thursday, uh, and Sunday as well. Uh, taking on the dailies. Thursday night race club. Uh, and all that good stuff. So make sure you tune in for them, affinityracing.co.uk for merch and all that good stuff. And I shall see you in the next video. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you hit that like button, hit subscribe for future videos, future episodes, and more content just like this. And while you're down there, make sure you check out our description for links to our merch store to get hold of awesome t-shirts just like this one. Any orders on the merch store goes a long, long way to supporting channels just like this. I also think the t-shirts look pretty cool, so make sure you grab what you can, and I shall see you in the next episode.